The next generation graphics cards from AMD will be using a brand new gaming architecture called Radeon DNA or RDNA that promises to deliver incredible performance and power efficiency. While delivering a keynote address at Computex 2019, the Red Team announced that the same technology will be used to run the graphical capabilities of the PlayStation 5 as well. Sony had previously revealed the PlayStation 4 successor to be utilizing a semi-custom design based off the AMD Navi lineup. What came as a surprise was that RDNA, which is a product of that same AMD Navi lineup, will be replacing the previous generation graphics core Next or GCN architecture in a comparatively smaller but powerful package. It's also interesting that the new gaming architecture is said to have been built from scratch to majorly meet the needs and requirements of the PlayStation 5. Hi, I'm Wes Malik from Segment Next, and here's what RDNA will be bringing to the table. Remember to hit the bell icon to get all notifications on our future content. According to a presentation breakdown provided by AMD, the new RDNA technology features a new compute unit design that's projected to give 1.5 more performance per watt and 1.25 more performance per clock over the previous GCN architecture. In addition, a multi-level cache hierarchy will be able to deliver better gaming performance at lower power consumption and reduced latency. This is what consumers can roughly expect from the PlayStation 5 since AMD has acknowledged that the Navi-based GPU of the next generation console will be a custom variant. In other words, you can expect Sony to have tailored the aforementioned technological specifications for vast performance improvements in different areas. These variations and their impact will only be determined once the PlayStation 5 officially releases worldwide, which looks to be sometime next year. There's still a lot that AMD and Sony need to reveal about the RDNA architecture. How big of a jump do you believe RDNA is from GCN? Let us know in the comments below.